What is going on guys and welcome back to the channel. It's been a while since we bought the cheapest Porsche Cayman 981 in the country. And we already did some stuff off camera like changing the rear tires and also changing the oil of the transmission. But you know what time it is. Like I said, I wanted to install a big wing on the back of this car. And it's finally time because this wing is going onto the car. This is a Techart Type 2 rear spoiler for the Porsche Cayman. And in this episode, we're going to install it on the rear of the car and even try to paint it ourselves. In order to install the spoiler, there's a lot we need to do. For example, we need to stop the automatic spoiler from coming out. And we also need to drill some holes in the back of the car. <laughs> so without further ado, let's start. To prep the wing for paint, we sand it down with a 400 grit sandpaper. After the sanding, we spray a filler primer over the parts. This will create a nice even finish. The finish is a little rough, so again we sand it with a 400 grit sandpaper. Time for paint. Spray some light coats first and follow up with some heavier coats. Now to seal the color paint and to give it a nice shine, we spray a 2K clear coat. Again, start with a light coat and finish with two heavy coats. Well, it's the next day and the wing is painted. But I made a rookie mistake, so I'm going to show you what I did and how we're going to fix it. Well, I waited 6 hours and thought the paint had fully cured. I laid the wing down on the stand with a towel in between and this resulted in damaging the clear coat, which can be seen. To fix this and to get rid of the orange peel, we sand it down and polish it afterwards.
Well, now that's finally done. Time to put it back together. I'm going to relocate the badge. First we outline the letters with some tape, so we know how to apply the badge again. A heat gun and a plastic squeegee will get this badge off in no time. Well, now comes the most nerve-wracking part, actually drilling holes in the back of the Porsche. We only have one shot, one opportunity, to drill a hole we want. My palms are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy, vomit on my sweater already, mom spaghetti. Expensive cars never fun. Now to complete the modification we have to disable the rear spoiler. TechArt provides a kit which modifies the engine and the assembly in the rear but it's a lot of work and I don't have the parts. So all I can do for now is remove the fuse and I'm going to show you which fuse it is and eventually I have to go to Porsche and ask them to program the spoiler to only come out at 300 km per hour. That's something I can't do myself and that will eliminate the error message I will get from removing the fuse. Now I already tested it at 130 km per hour. It will not give me an error message in normal mode, but in sports mode it will give me an error message. But it's a simple tap and it's gone and I can live with it. Well, it's this one right here. I already removed it. It's number 30 and this will only disable the rear spoiler. Now there's one thing I still have to address and that's the rear struts. They're not strong enough so I will have to replace them by TechArt once.